Hello everyone, it's been a while, uh, sorry for not uploading, but that's what this video is mainly for, so I can start talking about why. I had quite a lot of life uh, things happening, I had to commit myself like for a full week almost, <clears throat> but it's all done, it's all, it's all out of the way now, so uh, should ha should be able to make a few more videos, but... As you can see, I'm just doing the uh, Eliza Price fight. Just gonna get top 10%. And once once I've done that, I'm gonna go on the alt account because I do want to talk about obviously some progress that I've made because I haven't I haven't just like completely abandoned it. I have actually been playing it, and I've been playing it a lot more than than what I normally do. So once we get once I'm finished here, I'll go on it and talk to you about that. But but uh. Yeah, I just want to apologise for not uploading in general, because I should be, but that's not going to connect. I should be anyway, but or it should have been, but Cinco de Mayo happened, I livestreamed that, and that was very enjoyable. <coughs> so if you did show up to that, I, I thank you a lot, and I appreciate it. Uh, one of the main things we got done over the over that course of that weekend was uh, this headhunter and this evergreen here. We got them evolved through that, which was uh, very good because I needed both. Not only have I done that, but I've got my second uh, natural diamond maxed out now, finally, uh, by Brandon, which I did recently. Uh, but yeah, I didn't upload the rewards on both accounts because they were they were pointless. I only got like I, I'm pretty sure I got gangrene after gangrene. I don't remember getting anything else. And I didn't want to upload an opening of just that. But obviously, I did I did upload the legendary relic and the diamond, but they were a little bit disappointing for me, mainly because they were both duplicate. But what can you do? It's a look of the draw thing, right? But, yeah. Hope you've all, uh... Hope you all got some good stuff out of that. But, uh, I think that's... I think that's it for this bit. I just wanted, I just wanted to talk about, like, I haven't been uh, uploading or streaming for a while. Just because I had a lot of life things. I might stream later. Like, might. I don't know if I will. I might. And it might just be Rift, so <clears throat> if you want to turn up for that, I won't give you a time. I was about to give you a time. I won't give you a time because I always give times and then not do it. So, yeah, I, I if I do, uh, my name on Twitch is the same as this, Striker SGM. So if you end up showing up there, uh, you can just I'll just have a chat with you. We can talk about whatever, really. It's quite a chill. It's quite a chill thing. And if nobody really, if only like one or two people turn up, that's honestly fine. I don't mind it either way because I enjoy it regardless. It was it was very fun over the course of Cinco de Mayo, just being able to stream it and just being able to talk to people. So yeah. I'll finish this off, uh, finish off 10, top 10% 10 on this, and I'll hop onto the alt account, and I'll show you some progress. So, see you in a bit. Okay guys, I'm back on the alt account. Finished getting top 10%, went for about, I think, 19.2? I think that's what I stopped at, should be enough. But, uh, yeah, there's probably something that you can see almost instantly, and that's the fact that I don't have, uh, like, 700-ish Fear Knight anymore. That's because I did a Templar Swan, uh, and I'm going to let that play now because I've got it as a clip. I couldn't talk because uh, I was in a Discord call, so I had to just mute Defen, and it's just me opening it. So uh, I'll let that play out now. Right, this is take three of trying to record this section. I think it's because I was in photo, I was staring at a photo of just a black screen when trying to record it. For some reason it keeps doubling the time on it.
I need to remember that. It might be something to do with my phone being updated. I have no clue. What I'm trying to say for the third time is I don't have the 10 plus 1 recorded because uh, I opened it for a friend in a Discord call. I wanted, I screen shared it to him when I opened because I thought I was going to get something. And that's my fault because I didn't get anything apart from like five silvers. Um, there's, a, there's a silver I'm still looking for, a uh, hype man. Didn't get him. I'll explain why I'm looking for him later. But, yeah, I can't, I, I shouldn't have, um, I shouldn't have opened them. But I do have some Philia relics recorded, so if this section of the recording works again, ho or doesn't, if it works, I'll, this will be in here. If not, it's just going to be some text. But, yeah, enjoy the Philia relics. So yeah, as you saw, we didn't really get much. I think we got about four or five silvers. We got pretty lucky. But uh, yeah, did open it. Just didn't do like a short video on it or anything. That's not bad. But I'll show you everything else that we've been doing because as soon as I hit, as soon as I click collection, you'll see that there's quite a big change in that as well. I've Okay, the game's lagging, that was a bit weird. Uh, let me open these two, because could get an my. Which we did, I, I'm pretty sure we got one, by the way. I got another my on this account, I don't know if I already had one or not. But, I have an my now. And, when I was live streaming, uh, like during the Cinco de Mayo, I actually got two my's in a row on my main account. Absolutely, like, nuts. I've never seen that before. But I just want to double check, do we have another Oh My? Yanotech is new because that was a silver relic that I did the other day. Where's Oh My? Never mind then, I didn't get one apparently. I could have sworn I did. So we still have yet to get an Oh My, but... As you can see, that's the collection. Uh, it's all pretty, pretty much the same, except... Obviously the notable changes being Toad Warrior is now gold. Uh, Bad Hair Day is going to stay at silver, but she's 40. Rusty is now gold. Uh, who else? Didn't I do somebody else? The, yeah, Sheltered. Where's she? Sheltered is now a gold. And Inkling is now also a gold. So we've got quite a few done. Uh, Dark Might haven't really worked on, honestly, because not really worth it. I think Rusty... I maxed out the skill tree, yes. Uh, obviously, Bad Hair Day, I maxed the skill tree out on because it's way too important. Having her uh, be able to inflict Pama Bleed now is a huge game changer. And I think that's about it, apart from just buffing Toad Warrior quite a bit. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. But... Uh, that's it in terms of the fighters, I'm pretty sure. I did bloodbath a little bit, I think, and that's about it. I haven't really worked on Warsbane or Somersault because they don't need it. So there's no point using coins on somebody that doesn't need it. Uh, <clears throat> as you saw in the opening earlier, I did Philia Relics and then a 10 plus... Was it? Was it? Was it Philia Relics or Parasol? Because even way I know I did Philia... And I did Parasols Advanced, so it's one of those, but I know I've done both of those since as well. But I don't know why I clicked out of this, because I need to go back to it. Uh, we're on 97% completion of this altogether now, we're on 
in just master and we're still only on 74 percent on this because this is going to be a big issue and it's probably going to take me a very long time before this is completed if it takes too long i will move on to a sensible woman because i'm not going to wait uh, much longer but it's primarily this node down here that is going to be a massive issue and you might be thinking oh it's flytrap and like harlequin and whatever and that's the issue right no they're not scary in my, well, they're not something that they're still like very difficult but the problem is i need an f i need air only now air eliza i have in uh i have her in the sense that i have a bloody valentine the other way you could do it is if you had a standout and if you have a standout then count yourself lucky because that means you can use her instead but the problem is air beowulf now the problem with that is obviously I don't have a hype man <clears throat> and I don't have a snake bite. My old uh, second account when I was playing on that it actually I rolled a snake bite as my first diamond and that was very lucky. My main account very recently got snake bite and this account got dark might instead. If I had snake bite on this account as well that would have been crazy and it would have been really helpful. But I have to wait for a hype man. If he shows up in the shop, I'm going to buy him. I know it's not the best choice, but I did it with Perfect Dark. And I'm pretty sure I did it with somebody else. Mainly for progression. I pretty much have to. So I don't want to keep this I don't want to keep this series like stalling as long as as much as I have. It's nearly been a week now. It probably has been a week since I last uploaded anything. And I'm pretty sure it's been over a week quite a bit since the last time I uploaded anything on this series. So, uh, treasure node, behind it though, is not uh, really an issue. Must have double, no diamond. This one is either just gonna be double-licious or uh, it's going to be Rainbow Blight. And I'm leaning, honestly, to more, towards Rainbow Blight more because I tried using, uh, I'm gonna show you exactly why though. This node, I completely just cut off what I said before, but I'll show you in a minute. This node is just gold parasol, that's why I have sheltered at gold, need to work on her now. This one's silver only, it, that's why bad head is staying as silver, because uh, as you can see here, the modifier, I will survive. It is a very annoying modifier, in the sense that it, if it was worded as just regen, then it could be removed. But permanent regen cannot be removed. Regen that you see on... Uh... How can I say this as an example? Regen that you see on fighters like Flytrap, for example, when she defeats an opponent, she gets the 5 regen. It doesn't say how long it's for, therefore it's 5 stacks of regen that never run out. I'm pretty sure that is known as timeless, but it's not permanent. Permanent is something that you just cannot remove. The only way you can stop it is by uh, making sure it doesn't get inflicted beforehand. So if it's part of a fighter's kit, such as uh, such as Killjoy, then you would inflict Hex on Killjoy. But obviously it doesn't work on... No, I'm pretty sure it works on Killjoy as well. So you would inflict Hex on Killjoy so it stops. You'd also inflict Hex, obviously, to stop her from resurrecting. But the other way you would do it is Curse. But Doublicious and Rainbow Blight well, uh, for the other node, Doublicious and Rainbow Blight don't have access to Curse. They have access to Heal Block, which also works, but it's not a very long Heal Block, so it makes it very difficult. Uh, but for this, uh, Bad Hair Day obviously being able to Bleed Cheese, I can just give them 5 Bleed, the 5 Regen is basically mitigated completely, and it's just my raw damage that'll finish them off at that point. But... Also, Punch Through is being very annoying uh, in the sense that they'll just randomly do a dash hit. So, gotta watch out for that. But this one, uh, as you can see, double Big Band and Cerebella. This one is the one that's stopping me from doing much right now because I want to beat this one. Sorry if my voice went further away, I was scratching my arm. Uh, this one is going to be an issue because... I still need to work on the fighters that it needs. Uh, beatbox is 4k, 
Toad Warrior is 4k, and my closest double here has been Doublelicious mostly, is 2.6. So I have 11k power worth of fighter versus a 10.5 and an 8.8. .8. I can defeat the heavy handed just barely. The armed forces, the first time I got to the armed forces, almost every other hit was, was her signature ability proccing. I know it's only 5%, but it got frustrating. I'm going to have a go now just to show you exactly what I mean. Because I've got it. The problem with this modifier is you have to say so aggressive. And it doesn't really pay off. As you see there, I just got the first stack inflicted. There's the second. So I'm doing damage, as you can see. I'm still able to out. Uh, that got completely missed. I didn't think it would. She's able to do damage, as you can see. Does this hit? No. That's good to know. But yeah, I can do damage. But it, when I get to that point and they start getting four regen, oh, four regen stacks, it becomes an issue. Now she's got five, so I can just barely out damage this. If she grabs me, then she's dead. No. See? I still need to work on her just a little bit more. If she gets to about 6 or 7k power, so let's say about level 35-ish, then it's doable. Like, it becomes very much doable at that point. But Beatbox, he's not going to be able to do anything unless he gets some of his... Uh... The only way he can really do anything is if he gets in Rage. And I don't want to invest in that because obviously it only lasts for five seconds if i had an evergreen evil on this account then it might be worthwhile uh doublicious on the front line like as the first attacker though does does not work a because she's silver and b because she cannot transfer the permanent regen from them to herself i've already tried and that was the main reason why i did it uh the only other thing i can really do Apart from that, it's just try and do it, as I said, as Rainbow Blight, and level up her, uh, her signature ability, which I'm going to do, as I'm sitting on 300,000 coins, and now I've just realized I can do that. So, let me do that quickly, uh, if I have skill points, 46, it's not many. So I can just do that. That's fine as it is, 7 seconds of debuffs is okay. I believe, or it should be okay. But yeah, that's uh, that's all we're really at right now in terms of the star account. I can't really do much more unless I get a hype man like right now. Is there one in the shop? I didn't even check. No. So hype man is an issue. Uh, getting sheltered leveled up is now something I need to do and Toad Warrior and everything else I still need to work on, so... What I might do from now is... If there is... If... I'm trying to think of how I'm going to do this. I'm just saying words. Uh, if I was to level up Toad Warrior, and she's able to do it, I'll record it. But... If that's all I can do... Then I will move on to a sense of a woman. And I will probably also just do a bunch of origins. Or I, sh I say a bunch. Just probably finish off all the origins honestly. Because obviously Fear Knight and a lot of coins are still in there. But apart from that. Uh, we've only got 9 minutes until whatever. Did I do any of this? Yeah I, I actually did do a little bit as you can see. So I have been working on this account. I'm probably going to get this bit finished. Uh, as soon as I stop recording, so, yeah. So that, I think that's about it, really. That's all I can really share. It's been about an 18-minute recording, as per usual. Me knocking out the over, the, the massively lengthy videos for no reason. But if I, if I go live, uh, as I said in the previous section, I would love to see you there. If I don't go live, then this is the last time I'll see you until... Or the last time I'll be able to do a video or speak to... 
you guys through the power of telekinesis uh, for a while because of obviously having to progress this account a little bit further. So thanks for watching and thank you even more to, for listening to this guy ramble on and I will see you very soon. Enjoy the rest of your day.